We are in Brindisi today for the first in-person workshop of the Initiate Squared project. Initiate is an idea that uh, we hope that we can bring to life with the help of our partners. Officially, we launched in uh, June last year, 2021, during a G20 event that was hosted here in uh, Unitary Brindisi. But uh, the seeds of Initiate were planted before then in 2020 when uh, WHO and WFP really worked hand in hand for the COVID response. Initiate comes from the field, from uh, the people that has been uh, working for the last few years in uh, outbreak response in different countries, but people that face the same problem and people that have to develop solution in the field to make the response possible. Since now we were all concentrated on the response, we were all concentrated on coordinating among each other. What I think that Unishate is pushing us towards a unified approach in the preparedness. Responding to health emergencies requires being ready. Readiness means you are able to activate a coordinated response to address the immediate health needs of a population during an emergency. Up to today, we've been solving the problem on the way, on the field. We face a problem, we find a solution. This is why Initiate is so important. It is bringing together multiple humanitarian actors, NGOs, UN agencies, and member states to innovate solutions to our pressing logistical challenges. The interesting thing about what we're doing here, is I think it's the multidisciplinary nature of it. So it's not, again, from the lessons we learned, bringing in the architects and others, and in the room behind you see it's a lot of different expertise. The fact that we are here today is also especially important because of what UNHCRD is about, its history and about the facilities that we are in. This facility has got a lot of nice space, open space, and we definitely have one eye going forward on testing the solutions, those that are successful, then training how to put it up, how to install it, and then move towards simulation. The role of UNHRD in this project is related to its lab capacity. In Brindisi, we have a very unique team that is called the UNHRD Lab, which is a research and development center. And we are putting this at the use of the entire humanitarian community to be able to work on new and innovative solutions together. There is a multi-agency effort here to design a infectious disease treatment unit for deployment in future outbreaks, something we can deploy rapidly and we know from a lot of experience that being able to treat patients early in an outbreak may help uh, reduce the size of the outbreaks and reduce extension and save lives. In the end, it's, we are all here trying to solve a problem that is common to all, but. We have a very different approaching, and this is what makes for me the workshop most uh, rich and exciting. I think we've made some giant leaps forward. Being able to meet in person for the past three days, I think it's been extremely helpful for moving things and advancing things uh, a lot faster than they have been for the past several months. So we came here to learn in terms of how can we provide the highest level of care to all populations. So what we have to do is make sure that we bring solutions quickly that you can set up and manage these patients within 24 hours if possible. Having a good treatment unit which promotes community trust and is very close to an affected population means that we can get patients very early, start treatment early and have also good outcomes. And to design the optimal unit well, that's the objective of, of our meeting here. The next step, I hope it will be a very design creative step where we can put together everybody's idea and try to change in a positive way that can really help everybody to improve their work. 
Our hopes is that we have identified the best types of characteristics for a treatment center that then we can give to designers to start to design these types of facilities. The long-term vision of Initiate is to enable the wider humanitarian community to join force and work together to be better prepared to the next outbreaks and to offer the best service to our patients.